guys, we have got a boatload of subs. We're down here in Summerlin Key, and we're going to do something I've never done in my whole life. We're going to catch spider crabs by hand underwater, then we're bringing them back and boiling them up. My whole life I've seen them. I've never tried to eat one, but I just heard, hey, that's my favorite house in the whole planet, right there. I love that house. But, um, so that's my favorite house up there. But we are going back in the back country, catching spider crabs by hand, and y'all are with us. All right, so look at this. This is the exact same spot, just two days after mini season, and there's no boats. But this is our little bro Josh from Katy, Texas, and his brother and his dad. Here's Captain John. Yeah, on the helm. <laughs> All right, so what you, sh we should have some kind of contest. What's it gonna be? Ever who gets bit the worst, Gets a one dollar bill. All right, that's it. One dollar for whoever loses a finger. Right, I'm done. Okay, if I get bit the worst, I'm getting fifty. Let's just put that on there. The, the Annies are up. That's what happened last time. Mine went uh, after spider crab. <laughs> All right, so we don't know what to expect, but we're here on some of our favorite rocks where I've seen them in the past. We're gonna get in, spread out. That's our first spider crab of the day right there, y'all. I've been looking everywhere. I've seen a few lobsters, but that's our first spider crab. He's not the biggest, but right now he's the best. Look at that big boy! Yeah! We're catching spider crabs! Oh yeah, nice big spider crab.
I got my boys over here. Help me out. Dude, you're demolishing them. I'm sticking to your target. <laughs> <laughs> you guys like but I'm wearing my new eye view sunglasses that have a camera Ooh, look at that put them in there and then let, we're gonna figure out which ones are keepers and which ones we got to let go oh yeah that's a good that's nice look at that oh. beauty. Oh. almost earned my dolly <laughs> <laughs> all right let's say let's Let's do this a little differently. Let's blindfold him. Okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> that's a female, that's a male. See the apron that I'm pointing at? One's wide, one's thin. The thin one is a male, the, the wide one is a female. Let's let these guys go. These are just too small, so we'll let them go right here. Watch this. Welcome to your new home. We're gonna ring a bunch of lobsters and clean some fish, and we throw the carcasses in, they'll be eating on it. Another nice reason for having an ice machine in your backyard. Now we're gonna add water to make a slurry. Hey, if you guys think this is the most beautiful little blonde hair girl in the whole world, click thumbs up. Now, he's all slowed down. 
And what we're gonna do is pop that off. Now we're gonna try to pop the head shell off. Mm. Man, these jokers are tough. Look at that. Woo! Look at all that meat. I know he's gonna be good to eat. Mmm. Man! Never thought he was gonna be so nice. Look at all that meat. Oh my goodness. Now, that is the stuff we don't want to eat. And we'll just throw it in the water. All right, so you gotta excuse the mess. This is our last day in the Keys. We're cleaning everything up. And plane taking off over there. Oh, I got it on camera. Oh yeah. Okay. She's like, uh, she's like Annie Oakley with a camera. <laughs> but anyway, this is all we're using. Everglades heat. We're gonna salt it up real well. Then we're gonna put in some Everglades heat. Then we're gonna put in about this much vinegar. Why vinegar? The vinegar, when you steam or boil crabs, vinegar will make the meat sweeter and it'll make it easier to peel. So when this comes to roll and boil, you'll be, you know, you'll see. Game time, y'all. We're gonna take these clusters. Just start throwing them right in here, just like that. Uh, so it's 351, we're gonna let it cook for about 12 minutes. And then Stacy has some garlic butter cooking there. We're in good shape. All right. So let me just show you guys. Let's back up. What do you think of your crab? Like on a scale of one to ten? Nine. A nine. Give it a nine. How do you like yours? Best crab I've ever had. Really? Yeah. What about you? Delicious. Up there with stone crab. Yeah. Ooh. Oh wow. Mmm. Is that good? It's like stone crab. That's exactly what I said. It tastes exactly mm -hmm. like stone crab. Yum. Yay. Grab a knife and just pick it up. Mm. That's really good. It does taste like stone crab. But sweet. Look at that piece Look at of that. cavern meat. Look at that. I feel like it's sweeter than mm. stone crab though. I said the same thing. That's exactly what I said sweeter. whenever I tasted it. Yeah. You're not worried about the stone crab pots anymore, are you? Yeah. Uh, it's still something to do. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's what I'm talking about. That was just a 100% success. I had no idea what the day was gonna hold, but we went out, we caught a bunch of crabs. I passed up a bunch of small ones and the ones that we brought back that were too small, we let go. And everybody loved it and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for being a part of our channel and a part of our lives. We love you, and we will see you soon. We go.